In this video, we're going to be getting ourselves the cop outfit in GTA Online. It's a very easy method and you do need to bookmark one custom job off the Rockstar Social Club website. I'll leave links to both the Xbox job and the PlayStation job. And if you're on PC, I guess bookmark both of them and see whichever one works for you. After bookmarking the custom job, we need to restart our game and then we can press pause, online, jobs, play job, bookmarked. And it's going to be in last team standing. Now on Xbox, it's going to be called Cops and Crooks Classic 1 but on PlayStation it's going to be a different name it's going to be Cops and Crooks 1 basically without the classic in the name so we're going to load into this job and we need one friend to come and help us he doesn't really have to do anything besides join the job and sit there really so invite one friend to load in with you confirm all settings and start it and in the outfit selection we don't need to change teams or anything so we're just going to ready up right away and we should load in inside of the Pacific Standard bank we're gonna have a duffel bag on us and this cool looking outfit but what we need to do we're gonna have a car right in front of us spawn right here we need to get inside of it and wait until we explode once we get inside of it as you can see we have a bar on the bottom right we're gonna explode and that's gonna end the mission now what you want to do here wait till you get into the menu in the sky and we want to press lt on xbox to restart and swap teams or it's gonna be l2 on playstation i believe so just wait a second and i did just press lt and that's gonna restart the mission and we should spawn inside of a cop car with a cop outfit just like this so we're gonna be in this exact cop car and if we look inside of the car as you can see we do have the cop outfit on our character at this point it's very simple all we're gonna do is open the interaction menu we're gonna go into appearance go into accessories and put on any type of gear you want so this could be an earpiece or like a rebreather or something like that so i'm just gonna put on the lcd earpiece once you have any type of gear on we're gonna open our phone and quit the job and when we load back into an online session we should still have the outfit on us now this is semi permanent so i'll show you guys what i mean exactly we are in an online session with a cop outfit just like this now what i mean by semi-permanent is you can actually go and save it in your edit saved outfits inside of any clothing store but it's not going to stick after switching sessions or restarting your game but it is technically permanent because as long as it's on your outfit and as long as it's equipped it's not going to disappear off your character so as long as you have it equipped before you switch sessions or before you restart your game you are going to spawn with it the next time you hop on the only thing it disappears from is your edit saved outfits so you can go and save it in your edit saved outfits but there's no point really so just make sure you have this outfit equipped and as long as it's equipped it's not going to disappear off your character so it's all good it's technically permanent but when it comes to your actual saved outfits it's not going to be permanent on that list extremely easy tutorial hopefully this video did go on to help you out if it did drop a like on it subscribe if you are new help us get to 200,000 subscribers that would be much appreciated click the video on screen now to see how you can get get some other cool outfits in GTA Online. I hope you all enjoy that video, and peace.